So it seems like create a ballpark stadium creator create a stadium whatever you want to call it It seems like it is all but confirmed for MLB the show 21 if you guys are excited for MLB 21 definitely leave a like on this video subscribe for some more MLB the show content in the comment section below if we do have a stadium creator in MLB 21 which it seems like we will let me know everything you want to see from stadium creator what you think it needs doesn't need to be a good feature in MLB 21 let me know all of your ideas thoughts and everything like that down in the comment section in this video I'm going to go over why it seems to be confirmed and then also give my ideas for what we should have what i think we need from a stadium creator so hopefully on the screen right now you guys can see what i'm talking about this is from healy on twitter he tweeted this out i saw other people tweeting it but he was the first person i saw and mlb the show had a video on the sony san diego youtube channel where the description had a little bit of extra in it and it seems like more information could be coming even today maybe by the time this video is up shortly after shortly before i'm not sure but maybe even today it seems like more information could be coming up which i'll talk about that here in a second why i think some more stuff could be coming today but there was something in the description that got deleted it's no longer there it seems like we weren't supposed to find out about it yet and as y'all can see if you want to read along with me it says there are more ways to play than ever before and i'm gonna be the show 21 Take your ball player across game modes to own every at bat, every pitch, and every play. And here's the important part, okay? Fire up the new stadium creator mode and build the next great ballpark. And for the first time ever, MLB The Show is available on Xbox consoles and features crossplay with PlayStation consoles. It's your ball game, and MLB uh, The Show 21 own the show. Now, here is why I think we might be getting some information today on Thursday, okay? So from this the PlayStation blog post where they had the first coach in Tatis, which is what that video was from. It was from, I think maybe this video just on SDS's YouTube channel. I could be wrong though, uh, but it says every Tuesday and Thursday for the remainder of February, we will be releasing a new coach in Tatis video that showcases a different area of the game. These fun videos will give you some important nuggets of information about various improvements for MLB The Show 21. So, because it's Thursday today, I'm thinking maybe that description was supposed to be part of Thursday's video. I could be wrong on that. I could be completely off. Maybe today we don't find any more, but it seems to me like they might have slipped up a little bit and had the description for today or for a future video accidentally on the other one. So that's kind of what it seemed like to me. I'm not 100% sure, but that's why I think we could get some more information today. Like I said, though, it's not 100% confirmed. Yeah, it was in the description, but when I went to the video, it wasn't there. All I've seen is screenshots and stuff from Twitter, which I trust everyone on Twitter, but until we 100% hear something about it, I, I don't want to say that it's 100% confirmed for you guys, but it seems very likely. This seems very likely like it will be a thing. So now for the rest of the video, I want to talk about my ideas and I guess my must-haves for a ballpark creator, stadium creator, whatever you want to call it. Let's just call it create a ballpark. Maybe that could be the easiest thing, but here's going to be my must-haves, my ideas, and stuff that I think would be good for the stadium creator ballpark creator and it will be the show 21 so first off the big thing is i feel like it needs to be in franchise i feel like it really needs to be in franchise but i also feel like it needs to be in diamond dynasty now i know it could get a little bit cheesy but we're going to talk about that here in just a second but i feel like it needs to be in franchise first and foremost but then also in diamond dynasty i'm not sure what other modes it could really be in maybe custom league uh, but I feel like if it was in Franchise and Diamond Dynasty, that's pretty much the main modes where you would need a, a stadium creator. So next up on my list, I have a little bit of a list here that I'm reading, at least the idea from. And it's in no specific order, just kind of how it came to my mind. But the next thing is, I feel like you should be able to name the ballpark, whether it's just when you're loading into it, you have a sign. This would be preferable for me. You have a sign on the outside, inside, both if you want. But I feel like you should be able to name your ballpark, have a sign, and I will say, either give us preset naming options, give us a whole bunch of preset ones to choose from for your ballpark name, or have a really good moderation team and a really good profanity filter because that could get dangerous quick, allowing people to put their own names and stuff on the ballpark. I feel like you would definitely need to have a good filtration, moderation system like that, or just have a preset list, a big list of names 
for us to choose from. But I feel like it would be really nice if we're creating a ballpark to be able to name it and have that name on a sign somewhere inside the ballpark, outside the ballpark, or maybe a little bit of both. So I feel like that would be good. Next up on my list is color schemes. Now this is just in general. I feel like on the ballpark, you should be able to choose the color whether you want it to you can maybe have a default thing to match your team colors or just go all out and be able to choose a specific color for everything have the option to do both i feel like you should be able to choose the colors of pretty much everything in your ballpark right walls seats um the roof i don't know but just be able to choose color schemes right i feel like that that would be perfect for designing a stadium especially the seats though that's number one is, is be able to choose the color of the seats and i feel like you need to have kind of like the same thing with diamond dynasty logo where you can choose from a color wheel choose lots and lots and lots of different colors not like 10 select ones i feel like you should really be able to customize it and this is where i guess i'm covering the kind of cheesy part okay next up for what i think you should be able to control is the dimensions of your ballpark so left field right field center field and my so people might make it cheesier like oh well what if everyone makes like a hundred foot fence or a thousand foot fence right i think there should be limits on it now what pops into my head instantly is for left field for right field for center field take the ballparks that are currently in the game and that you're currently able to play with and for the floor and the ceiling the lowest the highest the shortest the longest dimensions have the shortest left field that's the shortest you can make your left field the shortest right field that's the shortest you can make your right field the longest center field that's the longest you can make your center field right so i, I don't think you should be able to just be able to choose a hundred foot fences a thousand foot i think it should be limited by what's already in the game i don't think you should be able to go shorter i don't think you should be able to go longer than what's already in the game and i think it also should be personally specific to left field right field center field uh, because otherwise you could have like 220 all around and I just don't think that's a good idea or whatever polar grounds is like 238 but I feel like if you have limits like that both low and high shortest and longest I feel like that would be a good way to stop at least some of the cheese that might make it not fun if it is an online play I don't even know and like if they if they do have this I don't even know if it's going to be offered in diamond dynasty I really hope it is but still for franchise you know um I think it would be cool to see limits but when I'm talking about these limits, I guess I'm more meaning online play. Uh, for franchise, man, I would love to be able to do a 100-foot fence for franchise. I think you should be able to maybe not have as many limits or restrictions in franchise. Now that I mentioned it, add, add that to the list. And if it's in Diamond Dynasty, if it's in franchise, have more limits online than you do for offline modes. I feel like that's way better in my opinion, but... Y'all might feel the same, y'all might feel differently, and that's what I want to see in the comment section. How you feel about everything, your ideas, my ideas, anything like that. Let me know, let me know. Next up on my list, and I will say, I feel like I'm talking a lot, talking kind of fast, but that's what this video is. I have a lot of ideas that I want to cover, and I don't want to drag it out more than I already am. So, next on my list is I feel like you should be able to choose the material, at least of the outfield walls. Uh, I, I do think it'd be nice to be able to choose it of like stuff in your ballpark in general, but especially the outfield walls, right? I feel like you should be able to choose wood, brick, ivy covered brick, ivy covered wood, I guess, uh, just padding, choose the color of the padding. Something that I think would be really cool would be to have patterns and designs and textures. And maybe if you go 12 and 0, you get a special wall text uh, texture that has like a flawless design on it it says 12 and 0 on like each panel or something like that uh maybe depending on your level right once you hit the bronze once you're in the bronze levels you have bronze walls once you're in silver you could choose silver gold level you choose gold diamond you could have diamond if you want it on your walls and then maybe once you hit prestige especially if there's more than one prestige i feel like there better be but say prestige the first one with that red diamond you could be able to have the red diamond prestige stuff as a texture for your wall i feel like that'd be really cool and I feel like having new walls to unlock, new textures, patterns, colors, whatever it may be, would be fun to unlock for your creative ballpark if it is hopefully, in fact, in Diamond Dynasty. So I think that'd be really cool. And this one, I think is a no-brainer. Next on my list is I think you should be able to choose the backdrop and the setting for your ballpark, right? If you want it to be, I was gonna say in the snow, but like in a desert, a beach area, in a city, out in the country, a whole bunch of corn, maybe uh, in a zoo. I don't know. Just you could have a whole bunch of different backdrop options, a whole bunch of different setting options. And I think that be, could be really cool. 
and i don't know how many customization options you could have maybe 10 to 20 or something but i feel like it would be really cool to have just different ones maybe you can mix and match maybe do a city but the background is like desert or mountains or you're in the country with mountains i don't know you can just mix and match different things to try to make it a little bit more unique so not everyone's having the same one right have like 20 to choose from from the close proximity 20 to choose from from the long range proximity stuff like that i think could be a good idea and i think you should be able to choose the backdrop and the setting for your ballpark next up on my list is choosing the elevation so a lot of y'all probably already know that's one reason people play at ship it laughing mountain cores is because the elevation is way higher so it's a little bit easier to hit a home run in those ballparks and i feel like you should be able to choose the elevation your ballpark is at uh it, it does impact gameplay a little bit but that's where you know if you don't want it to be super cheesy you could have limitations right whatever the lowest elevation is for an existing ballpark whatever the highest elevation is for an existing ballpark you just make the highest the ceiling the limit the cap and then the lowest the floor the the limit the cap for the short the, the lowest you're able to make it so i feel like that would be another good way right to make it so it's not super cheesy you're just able to choose within a range of what's already available i feel like that would be a great way to do it at least in my opinion next up on the list i feel like you should be able to choose if your ballpark has a roof you could either have one not have one or have one that's retractable i feel like those would be three good options to have uh, and then that way, you know, if you do have a retractable one or an open roof, then the, the backdrop still does matter. If you do, if you have a roof, maybe the backdrop doesn't matter as much. But I feel like you should be able to choose whether or not you have a roof. And if you do, if you want it to be retractable or not, so you can choose when it is open or when it is not open. I feel like that'd be fun. Another thing next up on the list is I feel like you should be able to choose how many seats and I guess maybe how many fans there are, but uh, in general, how many seats. I feel like you should be able to have a lot or a little, maybe choose where they are if you only want stuff in the outfield, if you only want it in the infield, uh, and then kind of going off that, I feel like you should be able to choose the type of seat, uh, type of seating, whether you want bleachers, normal seats, maybe no seats at all, so all the fans are standing. Uh, I feel like that'd be kind of cool. And I might accidentally come up on this later on the list again, but I'm going to mention it now. I feel like you should be able to choose how many decks, how many levels your ballpark has, wh whether you want it to be one, two, three. I don't know if any of the ones in the game have four, uh, but, you know, just have lowest at, I guess, the base one, number one, and then highest, whatever the highest is in the game. I feel like would be cool to have. Next up on my list I have the color of the grass or the dirt. Maybe if you want an entire dirt, even outfield. Maybe if you want a grass infield. Maybe if you want a, a grass infield, dirt outfield, be able to mix and match a little bit. I don't know if I would like it if you could choose the color of the grass. I feel like that could be kind of weird, but you know, what if I want blue, green, yellow, red, black, orange, uh, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, violet, right? What if I, I what if I want to choose the color of the grass? Is that something you guys would want to see? I personally see no problem with that. I would like to choose it. I don't know if you guys would like people being able to choose their grass, but I feel like it'd be, uh, it could be kind of fun, but might also be kind of annoying if you load into a ranked seasons game and see like yellow grass and a blue infield. I don't know. Maybe that's something you guys want. Maybe it isn't. I personally think it would be kind of fun to, uh, to mess around with a little bit and then also maybe choose a pattern you know how sometimes they mow patterns into the grass like a crisscross or st louis does the arch maybe be able to choose the pattern in the grass i think that could be kind of cool uh next up on my list we're getting to the end i promise next up is advertisements and advertisers maybe have special ones like from the giants ballpark you have the giant coke bottle maybe have special ones that you can put in your own ballpark and maybe put uh choose where you put them and then just whatever advertisers are in the game whether it's coke nike uh jordan under armor whatever just be able to choose advertisers advertisements where you want to put them do you want them on your walls maybe on the grass if you want them um signage for advertisers lots of different stuff i think it'd be a lot of fun to be able to choose advertisements advertisers and where those advertisements are located and maybe have the special ones like that big coke bottle uh like the chick-fil-a cow 
I think that's in the uh, the Braves one, SunTrust, right? Maybe have stuff like that. Maybe the Apple from the Met Stadium. Just have different stuff, advertisements, kind of cool little features to add into your own. And I guess that kind of goes on to another one. Just have features, you know, maybe if you want an aquarium behind home plate, maybe you want some big fish statue out in center field. Just have different features to be able to add and be able to choose where you put them, I think could go a long way skipping how many decks and levels because we've already covered that a little bit uh we've already talked about if there's a roof and then the last thing that i want to talk about i'm sure i'm forgetting something i'm sure i'm forgetting some ideas and i would love to see them in the comment section maybe do an updated list in the future uh with your guys's comments and everything like that as we get closer to release but i feel like you should be able to choose your scoreboard how big it is what it looks like where it is if you want more than one scoreboard maybe i want one in left one in center one in right that are all giant you know i feel like you should be able to choose different scoreboards maybe you have ones from certain stadiums like the rockies the little mountain uh you could put that in yours if you wanted it maybe make it bigger maybe make it smaller maybe put it in right instead of left stuff like that i feel like would be really really cool to have and like i said that is it for my list my throat's definitely a little bit sore. I talked a lot in this video. I'm hoping I have timestamps on this one at least a little bit um, so that you guys can kind of find what I talked about, what I didn't talk about. And I can't wait to read your comments for anything that I missed, anything you guys agree with, disagree with, any of your ideas on a ballpark stadium creator, whatever you want to call it. I can't wait to read it in the comment section. Like, subscribe, all that good stuff. I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day. Thank you as always for watching. I'll see you tomorrow.